Hey there, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today, we have an exciting video lined up for you where we'll walk you through the process of setting up a Django project. Are you ready? Let's get started. Step 1 Activate your virtual environment. Open your terminal or command prompt and navigate to the directory where you want to create your Django project. Step 2 To activate your virtual environment, type the appropriate command for your operating system. For Windows, it's conda activate env underscore name. Step 3 Once the virtual environment is activated, you'll see the name of the virtual environment in your command prompt or terminal. This indicates that you're now working within the virtual environment. Step 4. Now, let's start a new Django project. In your terminal, type Django admin start project project underscore name and replace project underscore name with the desired name for your project. Step 5. After creating the Django project, navigate into the project directory using cd project underscore name command. Step 6. With the project directory as your current working directory, it's time to add a new application. In the terminal, type python manage.py start app app underscore name and replace app underscore name with the desired name for your application. Step 7, Django will generate the necessary files and directories for the new application. You can now start building your application within the project structure. Step 8, to include the new application in your Django project, Open the settings.py file located in the project folder and add the application name to the installed underscore apps list. Step 9. Save the settings.py file and you're all set. Your new application is now part of your Django project. Step 10. To run your Django project locally, type python manage.py run server in the terminal. You can then access your project in the browser using the provided local server address. Congratulations! You've successfully activated a virtual environment, started a new Django project, and added a new application. Now you're all set to dive into Django development. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more Django related content. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.